media meeting. Tomorrow he sees a mouth-watering semi-final between the Olympic champions France and the world and European champions Italy. I'd like to just take a moment to welcome everybody in the room, media all over the world, all over Europe, and everyone at home as well, all of the volleyball fans especially. You can catch all of the games tomorrow on Eurovolley TV, but mostly it's time to welcome the people next to me. Nando De Giorgi to the left of me, welcome sir. Thank Simone you. Di <laughs> Gianelli, the Italian captain to the left of me, just inside and to the right, Benjamin Toniuti and Andrea Gianni. Welcome everyone. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to work from the outside <laughs> in, okay? Uh, Andrea, firstly, um, welcome. You've uh, been such a historic figure of this competition. Um, now you're back in the final four with, with France. Yeah. What does this competition mean to you? Because I think to this competition, you mean a lot. Yeah, but this competition is, is important because uh, we enter in uh, the big level, no? Uh, in this moment, we, we play the, the first round, the eighth or final, the quarter or final, but the important moment is uh, the final four. In the next step, uh, in the semifinal, we uh, met a big team with uh, Italy, and um, yesterday night, uh, the Italy show us with uh, they have the stronger team, especially they have a uh, uh, good mentality, good attitude uh, for to um, find the solution in the bad moment of the match. So you, four times you've won this competition um, as a player. What, what did it mean to win it as a coach? <laughs> I, I no, it's, I it's a different. It was, it's a different. When I was a player, I was a coach. and. Uh, for the, the coaches are different. We don't touch the ball. No, uh, it's different to show the emotion during the match. Uh, but for me, every time it is a it is a pleasure to play this kind of the match. And the emotion when uh, you win is a big difference. Uh, and we want to arrive in, uh, in the end of this uh, tournament. Thanks, and on the down. Here yes. With you. How was your journey this morning? It was a big game for you last night and an early, an early lead. Um, I, I want to say first of all one thing because uh, for uh, for us this um, European Championship organized in Italy is very important. For our movi movement is very important. Uh, we took a trip in uh, to many cities. In all the city was an unbelievable situation for us. Wonderful situation. I want to say this because for us it's very important. Uh, for Gianni, I don't know what I think about Gianni. I think <laughs> Gianni is my friends, but uh, we we have al always in this uh, last year uh, the very important match again. But uh, but I, I think uh, for us uh, is uh, we are very proud to arrive to arrive in this, this semi final, very proud to play for the medal. You know, French uh, is very strong team, uh, technical team, experience. Uh, I think um, for us uh, is important to continue to to think about our playing, our play, our mentality. Uh, to play in this match, uh, to, to find the always, Johnny uh, say good, uh, there's the solution because sure the, these matches are very difficult to match. It's important to to have good mentality, good attitude to play in the moment by moment to, through the match. This is very important. Of course, and a, and a few words uh, for last evening, last night. It was a it was a big game. Uh, what were your feelings going into the fifth set? And how proud of you of the team afterwards? Yes, this is was. Uh, I think I, I think the my player because it was my player was warri warriors, warriors, yeah? warriors, yeah, warriors, yeah. warriors, yeah, warriors, yeah. I think, think. <laughs> bravo, Giannelli, bravo, <laughs> Giannelli, very good, very good. But was the match very, very yeah. hard, very hard. In the fifth set, we play um, the our our best, the maximum, all the players. I'm proud for this, but we close this match. Uh, we start another against Tony T because I know very well Tony <laughs> T. Uh, he's a player, I know. What do you, what do you say to that? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, for sure it's a... Uh, microphone. Uh, no. no, no. See? 
Okay. Yeah, for sure. Uh, everybody know each other because uh, a lot of French guys play in Italy. Uh, I have Fefe as a coach in uh, in Zaxa in Poland, so yeah, he he knows uh, the players and uh, also players know each other because uh, we play against each other almost every every summer. Uh, I think uh, a lot of people around the volleyball uh, were expecting this uh, final four. Uh, we play a Wagner tournament one month ago. And uh, I have this question already that uh, uh, could you imagine that uh, this Wagner tournament will be the, the final four in, uh, in Roma? And, uh, and yeah, uh, it's, uh, it's uh, I think, uh, good four teams. It will be a big battle to good semifinal. And we are just happy to, to be in Roma and uh, we'll uh, do our best to, uh, to bring back uh, a medal for, uh, for the French volleyball. Thanks. And just another actual question I had, had, plan, <laughs> had planned for you. 2015 um, European Championship was, was a big, big moment for you and for France. Um, how has <laughs> how has French volleyball moved on from from that sort of 2015, and what are your memories of that 2015 event? Uh, yeah, it was a amazing memory. F first uh, first uh, title, first gold medal for the French national team, uh, and especially uh, how uh, how we treat this competition because I remember a lot about this competition, uh, especially about uh, the mentality how we came back in uh, two games. Uh, we play against Italy in Torino, uh, and we were losing 2-0 in the phase group. Uh, we came back and uh, and won this game 3-2, and uh, and we have the same situation in the semi-final against Bulgaria. Uh, we were playing in Bulgaria. Uh, atmosphere was uh, crazy. Uh, gym was full. Tomorrow will be the same, and we fight until the end uh, this semi-final, and we. We won 3-2 against Bulgari Bulgaria, and then we played the final against uh, against uh, Andrea, against Slovenia, and uh, <laughs> and John Joe. And uh, yeah, for us it was a big success. Um, and yeah, we are just uh, looking uh, forward to 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 have uh, again this emotion and to to bring back France on the on the podium of uh, European Championship. Thank you. Finally. <laughs> Last night was was a big battle. How are you feeling tomo uh, today, even, um, and and how are the team? Ma, for sure, uh, last night was very difficult for us. Uh, it was a difficult match against a very good team with uh, one amazing player that is uh, Nimir Uh Yes, this morning uh, it was a little bit difficult to wake up, <laughs> uh, but uh, yes, now we are here. I'm very proud of my team because. Like I said before, uh, uh, it was uh, mentally difficult uh, last night, and uh, we came back after uh, an injury of Roberto Russo in the fourth set, and that was, uh, I think, uh, the sad point of this uh, this match. And uh, but yes, uh, we came back and uh, we fight uh, for f for Roberto and uh, for all the team, and uh, I'm very happy to be here. But now. This is the past, so we have to think about uh, tomorrow. And tomorrow we have a, a, a nice match against a very good team. We're just going to go back to the past one step, <laughs> and then we'll look at the future again. Two, two years ago, Katowice, uh, it was a big big win for, for Italy, winning the European Championships. New coach came in and you won the European cham Championships very quickly. Uh, how did that help towards the world title? Um, do you think that was a sort of like a defining factor of your team at, at that moment? But uh, three weeks ago it was a very strange situation because we play uh, the Olympic Games uh, uh, in one way, then we change the group, we change uh, the coach and we uh, we start a new, like a new era, you know? So with uh, a young team and uh, we, we start to to play another volleyball, to start to have another mentality. And I think that that European Championship was uh, amazing because uh, I don't know we practice like two weeks before the this tournament and uh, we are arrived there and uh, we play a very good uh, volleyball uh, and we arrived to win the, this gold medal and uh, yes now we are here this is the this was the past uh, it doesn't matter now uh, you have to 
to think about uh, the present and uh, to stay focused on uh, the, the right thing that uh, you can help that can help you to play uh, better volleyball. Thanks. Dre, coaching Italy, coaching against Italy, sorry, must never be easy. How does it feel to go up against them? I mean, I, I guess you're, I guess you're I guess you're used to it now. But it's easy, especially when uh, before not to start the the matches. But uh, when start the matches, I'm a coach of my player, and uh, it's not different to play here or in other country. It's important um, to have the the good feeling with uh, the player, the, with my team, with my staff. Because when we talk about, you know, we have a good team, we, we play together, we play together, and we need to have the same uh, em the same emotion. And it's, it's we have one door closed, you don't have 100% for the team. And when you play, <laughs> it's very, very important to this. The first part is sure it's difficult, no? But after, during the match, when the referee start the match it matches business is business as usual <laughs> <laughs> that's nice since since you've been in charge uh, i always remember you you took over italy just before 2021 euro volley i don't understand nothing <laughs> <laughs> that's that's also what my fiance says <laughs> but uh, in in 2021 yes. european championships yes was very special Yes, it was very special because say what say um, uh, Simone that we have a, a very smart time to small time to um, to prepare this uh, European Championship it was one um, change of generation the new player young player and only I think ten ten practices maybe maybe six practices and two friendly match to prepare this uh, European Championship, but it was unbelievable, unbelievable uh, moment for us. And uh, sure, I'm, I'm happy. We start to play mm, only to think about to, to play the, the new right, the new mentality for the national team. Also very important, the what means to have the Italy, uh, represent the Italy and to, to have the value and also to have the new possibility, opportunity for the young player. This was mm, the new, the new road, the new way, the new way very well, very well. I'm happy, sure, for this. Uh, we want to continue. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> depends the the opponent. And and a quick word for for Russo. Um, how is how is he? For, oh, Russo, I don't know because I I think this afternoon we have the um, exam to to know what happened. Uh, I don't know, for us uh, is not a big problem because Roberto is a very important player for us, but not, not, not only technical player, but for the team. But we prepare, sure, we have the other player who can play good. Yes, uh, I hope there is not the big injury. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, we, have a, we have a lot of depth. Just, just quickly thinking about the last two years. Um, how do you feel that the team has developed in that two years in, in more areas? Is there any specific areas that you think you can see a major improvement? Uh, we have to improve uh, in every skills of our game. So uh, I think that we work hard uh, this summer after the WNL, after we lose against uh, uh, USA and uh, Japan for the bronze medal. And uh, we watch a lot uh, these matches and uh, uh, we studied so to to know what we have to improve, what we have to uh, do in practice to to ar arrive here to to play a, a good volleyball. In what I don't know uh, every every fundamental of volleyball, you know. So uh, you have to practice a lot, and you do you have to have a good mentality. Perfect. Thank you, guys. Um, just going to open. Uh, up to you. Is there any questions um, from the media here? That's, that's usually a pretty good sign. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Okay. Um, okay in, in which case, um, that's all we've got time for. Thank you so much. Thank I know you that so much. you have an incredibly thank busy you. schedule, um, so we really appreciate it on behalf of the CV. Thank you for talking to us. Thank you. Thank you to everybody for joining us here today as well. Uh, we hope that you enjoy uh, the match tomorrow. I think it's going to be, be really special. Uh, remember, the Final Four starts tomorrow. You can watch it at home on uh, Euro Volley TV. Thank you for joining us at home, volleyball fans, wherever you're watching from. Thank you, everyone. And uh, that concludes uh, media meeting number two.